guys, welcome back. How you doing? Assalamu alaikum. Right today, I'm going to show you very pretty much how you can um, play games on Steam and that and stuff like that. Uh, most games obviously keyboard, yeah, mouse and keyboard. Yeah, some games are hard, awkward to control. Yeah, so um, you can do it by game game pads, and this I'm going to show you. Yeah? So you can do PS4 or Xbox. Yeah, and what I'm going to show you today is um, PlayStation 4 one. Okay, how to use that Bluetooth, and obviously a wired gamepad, a normal, you know, generic gamepad as well. Okay, so I'm going to show you now how to connect it and play the game. All right. Okay, so what, so what I'm going to do? I'm going to show you first how to do it. So if you look on the screen, you're going to see exactly how I do it. Yeah. So what you do? You go straight to the Steam in the corner. Then you scroll down. Come here, settings, and then straight in the bottom, it's got controller. What you do, go to general controller settings. So you go there. Now, here, you got all these settings here, yeah? So, what you do, straight away, you're going to see here the guide thing is always ticks, so leave it there. Now, you've got PlayStation 1, we're going to do in a minute. There's your Xbox, you've got a Switch Pro. Which I use it, but that's one another option. And you got the normal, you know, crappy gamepad, the cheap gamepads, yeah, wired. So we do both of them, yeah, PlayStation and this one, alright. So we do PlayStation first, alright. So before we do all this though, okay, as long as, long as it's here now, what we do is shrink it, because straight away first, you have to um, obviously get this one done first. You have to go to your settings, okay. On your PC, go straight to devices. All right. Now see here. Like I said nothing at all. Now obviously make sure you got um. What do you call it? Uh, Bluetooth little USB. Yeah, and you stick it in. Yeah. I'll show you. So this, like this little device, you're getting cheap. You know, eBay, wherever you want. Yeah. Really, it's like a, a Bluetooth device. Yeah. A little tiny one. All right. You stick down there and it will connect your pad, your gamepad, alright? So you stick down USB. So that's done, okay? Now you can start doing it, yeah? So what you do, you go to add Bluetooth devices, yeah? Okay? And what you do, you do the top one here, Bluetooth. And that's going to search. Now what you've got to do though, is this, yeah? You need to get your PS4 pad, gamepad, alright? Now what you do, which I'm going to show you, you got to hold the PS button there, all right, hold PS button, and the share button, which should be on your left hand corner, that one there. So the PS button and the share button, hold them both at the same time, okay, I'm going to show you what it does, all right. Sugar's flicker, really. Come on, all right. Give us one second. Ah, there it is. Right, well, should flicker will stay on, yeah. Now, if you look on the screen now, you can see input that's our pad, yeah. So, we click that, so that's connecting. The thing goes off again. So what you do, you hold the share button and PS button uh, part in the game, both same time. And it should flicker like that, okay? So that's connecting, yeah? Then you get this on the keyboard, yeah? And that's four zeros, that's all you do, yeah? That's all it is, then you connect, and that's it, it's all done. So it's all set up, ready to play, yeah? So that's done. So what you do now, you shrink that. Now you go back on that page you're in, this one here. And what you do, you press the PlayStation support one. Okay. When you press that, this blue light will come on. Alright, that means it's ready as well now, yeah? For the games. So what you do now, just take that one off, don't need to do that. 
Now here, PlayStation 4, yeah, press that. Now you press identify, and when you do that, it's just checking that your pad is operational, yeah? So identify, the pad will shake, okay? Rumble on that, so you know it's all up and running, alright? So you do that, it's all done, no problem. So what you do now, you get out of that, and you get ready to play. So I'm going to show you the gameplay now, that you can do with the old pad, alright? I'll show you the old screen as well now. And you can do wide as well, I'll show you in a minute. So there you go, it's config, it's all loaded. So it's ready to play now with this. But I'll show you all the controls so you know it works here. Yeah? So there you go, it's there, normally with this keyboard, it's say press spacebar. But it says press the A button, which is the X button here in the PlayStation. Press that. Uh, just do. Let's go to your game. I mean, my daughter played it, so I wiped it off now. But I'm going to do my own one as I show you how to do it. So you know the controls, yeah? So remember, you had to sync it up. You always hold that PS button and the share button at the same time, okay? You just hold it, okay, a few seconds until it flashes on the front here, yeah? And then he knows up and running. Okay, so obviously the joystick, yeah. Obviously I'm pushing forward here. So there you go, you've got your forward and backwards. Alright. Got your up and down, all that stuff, yeah. Also your X button for jump. Okay. I'll see your run, your run button as well. Obviously here, square. So yeah, the controls, all easy, yeah, from your gamepad, no keyboard. So pretty much, it's really easy, all gamepads, you can play any game now, no problem. Okay, so what I'm going to show you next now is the wired one, the cheap crappy gamepad, yeah, which also can be used, yeah. Okay, so what I'm going to do, we're going to pause that. Or exit to the main menu bit. So I'm going to do now I'll show you the wired one, yeah? So we get out of that. Okay. Right, so next one we do now, okay? So what you do, we go straight to here again, Steam. Go to your settings again. Controllers there, ready. Go to general. Take off your PlayStation. When you do that, that's going to go off. So click PlayStation. And that should go off. Obviously, here. Yeah. So there, it's taken off now. Take it off as well. Don't need that. What we're going to do now is put the old pad in. The wired one, yeah? That's what you don't need anymore. So what you're gonna do, you have to go to your settings again on the computer. Bluetooth one, just take it off, because you're not doing Bluetooth anymore. That's gone. Get your your normal crappy cheap gamepad, yeah, fibre from eBay or wired, yeah. This one got to stick into your computer. Alright, so that's in now. So the wireless is turned off as you can see. 
because don't need them now. And then you're going to put it on other devices. You'll find your USB joystick here. That's what I'm using now, yeah? The cheap crap one. Alright, so get rid of that. Go back to your Steam. Go back to what I showed you. You know, the Steam settings, controller, general. Then you're here again, yeah? What you do, you click the generic gamepad, yeah? That's that cheap crap one, alright? The wired one. Go to generic one again. Calibrate. So the controls are here. I mean, you can mess about with the sticks, but what's the point? So leave it. Just press OK. So it's all set up and, go, all set up and running now. Alright, there you go. So it's all ready now. Get out of that. And this one as well. Let's go into that game again. I'm going to show you how it works with this as well. This crappy bloody gamepad as well. So it can work with Bluetooth, PS4, or the Xbox, same thing. Or if I'm wired, you know, the cheap crap one, you can use that as well. So it's easy, really, really easy setup to do. Really easy. It says space bar, but just press normally number three on this bloody pad here. As you can see, going up and down. It works, yeah. Okay. So we're going to that one again. Same again. And then gain the controls. Similar to the PS4 one as well. So we are. We'll put it that one. So again, yeah, it works the same way as the PS4. Alright. Works the same way. Okay, so you've got the joysticks, your pads, all that stuff, yeah? Okay. See, so yeah, it works, works both. Same thing, see? Jump in. Whole lot. Okay. Really easy. So, there you go. So you see, oh yeah, it works with the wire pad. And the Bluetooth PS4 or um, what you call it, uh, Xbox as well, yeah. So you've got three choices there to work with your games now, no problem. Or of course the keyboard, yeah. But some games you need the keyboard, like Scribblenauts or any other platform game, yeah. But these sort of games definitely easier with the gamepad. When you, when you play your games, you'll know what's better anyway, yeah. So again, yeah, got the choice now with these two. Really easy, yeah? You know, set up now, so no problem. So, enjoy your gaming.